Hey guys, welcome to Watch Hat Sauce. My name is Lou, and this is a segment that I like to call Lou's Reviews, where I talk about movies that are butt spankingly new, ready for you to view. But before you do, stick around to hear my review on. Prisoners. Hugh Jackman, who we all know as Wolverine, and Jake Gyllenhaal, who I affiliate with Donnie Darko, bring their A game to the new thriller, Prisoners. So for my quick little overview, or my quicko, for a two and a half hour long movie, it was kind of slow, but that's the reason why the movie worked. This complex and very disturbing tale really sinks under your skin, accompanied with very amazing performances, and it's one of the best thrillers I've seen this year. Earlier this year, another very good thriller came out called Side Effects. The first 20 minutes, Channing Tatum dies, just like in G.I. Joe Retaliation. But like Prisoners, it was a two hour plus movie with a lot of twists and turns. But because of this, just when you thought you've got this movie figured out, you don't. Now, if you've seen the poster of the movie Prisoners and you take a look at the letter O, it actually looks like a very weird, complicated maze. And that couldn't have been a more perfect example or a metaphor to symbolize the movie. So when things start out in the movie, it's Thanksgiving with two neighboring families, the Birches and the Dovers. But then suddenly, their daughters disappear, Hannah and Joel. And then suspects and witnesses start pointing to an RV driven by this creepy guy named Alex Jones, played eerily by Paul Dana. But with a lack of evidence, the father, Keller Dover, played by Hugh Jackman, takes matter to his own hands, which leads to very morally challenging and disturbing consequences. When I was watching the movie, and when you watch this movie, try to figure out how they use the title Prisoners on a denotation and connotative level. Denotation is the literal surface meaning, and connotation is the under the surface secondary meaning. The more you know, because knowledge is power. So, to wrap things up, Prisoners was a very dark and complex movie filled with great performances, and it's one of the best thrillers I've seen this year. Lou's Reviews gives it 4.1 missing milk cartons out of 5. So next week, I'll be checking out the new movie Rush starring Thor! Sorry. But if you like what you've seen here so far, just look down below, like, and subscribe, and you're good to go. You've seen the trailers, he's on a mysterious planet that nobody knows about, thrown off the cliff, 